You know, when you're going through a difficult period, when you're going through a painful period, when you're going through a, a, a situation where you feel nobody understands you, the phrase or the sentence you just don't want to hear is, it is well. <laughs> you might have said it to somebody several times. But when you are in that situation, you don't want to hear it as well. It will get better because you look left, right, I mean, up, down. <laughs> you don't see anything happening that makes you feel that it can get better or it will get better or it is well. But it always gets better. There's always a silver lining to every cloud. Always. You can be at the bottomless pit. But even there, something good can come out of it. Something positive can come out of it. So let me ask you today, what is your situation today? What are you going through? How are you going to deal with it? What have you decided to do with what you are dealing with today? What are you thinking about how are you positioning your mind? How are you even reaching out to help people in the same situation as you? You know, when I was in quarantine and I was doing the videos to encourage people and motivate, most of the comments I had was, I can't believe that you are in the same situation and you are encouraging other people. Yes, I was there and I was still mothering and mentoring other people in the same situation. And yes, I was scared as hell. Yes, I was confused. But then I decided that I wasn't going to let that fear, that, that anxiety, that uncertainty conquer me. It was a struggle. It was stressful. I wept many times. But through it all, I wake up in the morning, I wipe my face. I couldn't sleep at night. I slept throughout the day. And in the night when I couldn't sleep, I wrote. I wrote. Not just a book, but on social media, on WhatsApp, to friends and loved ones, just to encourage them. I'm not superwoman. I don't have it all. But I decided that I was not going to let it conquer me. I remain a woman with super crazy faith in God. I know he's got us covered, but he's given us wisdom. Sometimes he allows us to go through the valley of the shadow of death. It's a valley. And it's the shadow of death. But if we don't realize that it is a shadow of death, the fear will kill us in the valley. Thanks for watching. See you same time next week. And make sure that whatever you do, stay positive. Bye for now.